you know, from being a guy to, to being the guy that's going to have to call a lot of the shots in the back end? Um, I mean, it kind of just changed from having to be more of like a secondary leader compared to now. I'm like, I am like the primary leader. I mean, I learned from Devin Jones, Thad Engel, Jared Moore, all the previous safeties that I played under. I learned from all of them and took all their examples they set for me. So, I mean, I have a pretty good base and just ready to go when I'm accepted the challenge. So. It should be should be a good good year. You ever look around back there and and, and wonder, you know, where, yeah. you know <laughs> where where is everyone else at, yeah. man? You guys are a bunch of youngins. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Um, definitely, just all the guys I came in with since I was a freshman, just looking around and seeing like not too many guys left. So, I mean, but the young guys are really good. Of course, that is still like a little learning curve, but they're catching up on everything really well. They're handling information really well. They're listening really well. So, I mean, everything's going really good. And I say we're probably ahead of where we probably. People probably think we are where our coaches probably thought we were. So I think everything's going really good. So you feel some of the young corners, some of those young yeah. safeties have yeah. developed I mean, that, you know, uh, ahead of schedule just a little yeah. bit. Yeah, I mean, I know everybody has the doubts because we're inexperienced in the secondary, but I still but I believe in our secondary, and I think that everybody came along really well, and I feel like everybody's ready to compete. It doesn't matter how many years of experience you have. If you can play, you can play. So I think it's going to be a good secondary regardless of experience. Uh, defensively, the front seven, I think a lot of people recognize that the talent there, the experience back. Uh, so is there more pressure uh, on, the, on that quartet in the secondary? Do you, uh, you, you know, to, to pull your weight, given what you guys have up front on the D-line and the uh, linebacker spot? I mean, if anything, it just helps us out because we know we're going to have a pass rush. We know the linebacker is going to handle the run really well. But at the same time, we have to carry our own weight. and. Everybody that from what I'm talking to just in the locker room and just in the meeting room, everybody's up to the challenge. And if anything, that's pushing us even more than a normal summer, a normal fall camp. So everybody's going even that much harder just because people are downing us and because people are questioning what we're going to do. And your defensive back, there's pressure every play. Right, yeah, right? and yeah, next play anyway. Pass, so. pass or fail, yeah, every yeah, snap. Yeah, yeah. But uh, I mean, we made a lot of plays the whole fall camp, and then the corners are coming along well, making PBUs, interceptions every day. So it's going really well. Uh, you've played a lot of football here, but you're one of those guys that tends to be uh, under the radar, quiet. Uh, uh, what is it about your personality that's allowed you to, to kind of blend in, but at the same time not demand a lot of attention? Um, Does that make sense? I mean, I don't, that's just the way I, I guess that's just the way I am. I don't, <laughs> I don't really know how to explain it. I mean, everybody makes plays. It's just whether you know you get your name called, or you don't get your name called. But it's not about that. It's about just winning and helping the team win and just playing your role. So. Uh, what is the biggest thing you, with your game experience, that you can you can pass on? Is there a tip? Is there a technique? Is there a, uh, something else that you're trying to give to a Tyler Tupa uh, or to uh, you know someone else who's playing for the first time? That's a good this question. Year? Uh, I think my biggest advice is just telling them just go play football. Like don't overthink things. Don't don't question yourself. Don't doubt yourself. Just go play and trust yourself. Like you got you got a scholarship here for a reason. You're here for a reason. So all of us can play, so just go out there and play. Listen to your coaches, learn your technique, and just go out there and execute. Uh, for three years, you hit Bo Hardy. He was running the football this year. <laughs> yeah. You're trying to you're trying to teach him to hit less, I guess, yeah. with the contact rules. <laughs> yeah. What's it like having Bo as a position mate? Now? Very, very interesting. Very, very interesting person. I mean, he's a good he's a good person though. I mean, he's just really intense. You can't, you know, sometimes some people can turn that switch on and off. Sometimes people can. Sometimes the switch gets broke. But <laughs> you know, it's just. You'd rather tell somebody to slow down than tell somebody to pick it up. So, I mean, he he boosted our meter room up. This is energy and it's being intense all the time. So, was, it, was he tailor made to be like on a kickoff team? Yeah, kickoff yeah, he, team. He, he was tailor made to be a safety, I believe. I mean, he just doesn't. He just goes all out all the time, running to the ball, running through people, hitting people, going to the ball. Of course, he's fast, running like a four three something. So, I mean, he's made to be a safety. I think he just didn't know it yet. <laughs> And what would you like to get out of this year, uh, Torn? Is the MAC championship still the, the you know, the yeah. one thing for everyone involved in this program? Yeah, it's definitely just about the MAC championship. Just winning, winning big, getting the MAC championship. You know, just going out my senior year, MAC championship, bowl game, having the best year in Ohio history. Definitely, just I mean, a lot of team goals, and of course with team goals, like the team success goes with your individual success. So like the better our team does, the better individuals will do. So it's definitely just about winning championships and. Just playing really good as a team, playing our best game, playing our best game every week, having our best season.